Hey guys, welcome back to another video of Fishing Extreme Tasmania. We're out here, we've got Max Newitt. How's it going? <laughs> we've set the spread. We've got a couple JBs out the side and Meridian Flying Fish up the top. Uh, two Halco Deep Divers at the back. Just going to be working the rock for a little bit this morning and um, then we might wander down Munro's Bite. There was some good fish down there yesterday, so might head down there after a couple of hours here. So yeah, hopefully we'll see when we get a hook up. Okay guys, so with no luck for a few hours trolling, we're gonna head out of the stripey spot to stop the pillar. And um, yeah, we're going down to Adam for a bit of a look, but yeah, no luck. So we're just gonna go have a bit of a go for a stripey and see how we go. Hopefully we can avoid the seals with them. So yeah, we'll see when we get out there. Could be on a stripey here, hopefully. That off my head. Yeah, yep, big head shakes. Jump back a little bit, and I'll I'll grab the lock. Oh yeah, it's a stripey. Yeah. He's still fucking halfway down there. Uh, it's definitely a stripey. Yep. Actually, I'll just put you for a second. Yeah. Drop, your, drop your rod down, bro. Yeah, I'll slip off these oh. fish out. Oh, oh, yeah, there it is. Yeah, stripey. Yeah, See it? Yeah, 100% stripey. Yes! That's size too. Oi! Yeah. We've done it. Yeah! Give me, boy. Oi, I'm the King Brown, mate. Yeah, right. Yeah. Don't stress it too hard. Yeah, I'll just get away from the lines a bit. Are you up yet, or...? Yeah, he's I'll grab the gaff then. Got oh. Might as well bring this in then. Yeah, could be. Yeah, there's something down under us. I reckon steel's on the way now. Still there, though. Yeah. I can feel the tree. Yeah. I can't feel the tree. No. I can feel the fire. Yeah. Oh no. Shut the fuck up. Yeah? Yeah, oh he's in the race though. Is he? Yeah, look at that guy. Bloody hell. Yeah. Get him up, boy. Oh no. Go. Go hard, go hard, go hard. Oh, motor. Oh. Got him. Oh, that was hectic. Oi, put it there. We'll work for that. Oh. King Brown, what a First slayer, one. what a slayer. Got one fish, Max just dealing with that now. Just set the spread, we've got Meridian and JV out the side and we've got another Meridian out the back. Definitely can't get onto some better fish though. Want to set this one back there about probably 40 metres. Just far enough back but it's still working the way it should. No worries. Yeah, you're right. Oh, well, I got dog food. Beautiful. Yeah, boy. Fucking hell, that hasn't 
this JV. Bought that one yesterday. Really good looking lure too. They good barrel lure that one actually. So set this one just back a little bit further than that one there. about there put the clip on it too and then we've got the king brown you can see how smashed up that's been that's had a fair few fish hit it the last couple of days throw that out sit it i normally put them back so the wind on um, where the double goes is just starts to just on the edge of the water on the edge of the surface should be about there then we've got this other Hauco as well, which has been going off lately. And um, yeah, that's really good looking lure. It works really well too. That, those double D bibs just really pull it down. So once again, just until the double hits the water. About there. It's only about short of five metres, five, ten metres back from the boat, but yeah. Anyway, see if we can try and get onto a few more of these. Look at the water just riding up with bait. That's all bait, as far as you can see. Check that out. Look at all that. There is so much bait out here. They've gone down for a second but look at that there that's just bubbling with small red bait up there we've already seen about three fish jump big fish big fish look at the bubbling wow all bait fish up under the w and look at that just really small red bait like Four, three, four inches. See if we can't catch one of them barrels. That's not a barrel there, that's just bait, but 